Hello and welcome back to my Naples balcony. Thank you so much for coming to my YouTube channel and watching me. Um, today I want to talk about self-care. The reason for that is when I decided that I was going to rent an apartment in Naples for a month, move here, not as a holiday but really as sort of like a digital nomad, that kind of thing. Um, I assumed that it would be to do a big project. You know, maybe I would finally get the book that's been on the back burner for ages out of my head and kind of into a decent shape. Or maybe I would do some kind of big narrative kind of film, really up my filmmaking skills. And then about four weeks before I left to come here, I realized that neither of those projects was going to happen because what I needed to do was to look at my actual basics of my physical health and my self-care and use this time to get on top of them. So in January, I got a really bad dose of the flu. At least I assume it was the flu. I was achy and exhausted and I spent a lot of the days in bed and it, it wasn't very nice. And when I came out of that, I was really, really run down. And what was worse for me is that all of the kind of physical fitness that I had been building up over the last year completely gone um, and that I just found so dispiriting I was sort of at a lower level than I had been the year before and it's you know what even was the point and I think that if you've got you know a chronic disease but also if you are you know perimenopausal or menopausal or you've got small children or all of these things in life, when it makes becoming fitter, becoming stronger, becoming feeding yourself better, all of these things that you really have to work incredibly hard, so much harder it seems than anybody else, um, to have gradually pulled yourself up that hill of doing things to a three week illness or whatever, stopping it and you're back down the snake looking for a ladder to climb up. So when I looked at it realistically, I decided that the best use for this month was to really look at my self care. I'm living on my own for the first two and a half weeks so I have no excuses and to gradually set in place some really good foundations for going forward. So what does that actually mean? Well to me first of all it means a lot of rest and sleep and since I've been here I've been averaging about 14 hours sleep a day which is making such a difference because if I can get enough rest, then everything else can go kind of on top of that. It makes me less stressed, it gives me more energy, it makes me less noisy in my head somehow. There must be stuff when you're sleeping that just evens that all out. Second thing is to do a lot of moderate exercise. Now most of that is walking, you know, it's a beautiful city to walk in. Um, some of it is climbing stairs. I'm on the sixth floor of an apartment block and unless I'm carrying anything, my rule is I have to walk up those 124 steps, no matter how out of puff I am. And then the third kind of bit is, is really to nurture myself and to nourish myself with good food. and to eat mainly vegetables, to really um, 
be intentional with what I'm eating. And I mean, you know, you've seen the vegetable stalls. They are just out of this world. They're not um, any kind of limit to say, right, that's what I'm going to be eating. Fourth thing, I have a very busy mind, really trying hard to quiet that, to get rid of some of the noise in my head. So some meditation, lots of journaling, um, really being away from any other noise, you know, no music, um, no podcasts, just to see how that will work out. And then the fifth one is, you know, I'm in Italy, I'm in Naples, there are treats. So although I said all of that about food, that doesn't include ice cream. Um, and as long as I head off to the ice cream shop that is 5,000 steps that way, I think that's perfectly fine. Um, so that is my kind of plan for this time. And to really get to know this neighborhood where I am and wherever it is that I could walk in a kind of a circle around that. So all of the montage that comes after this was all filmed on a walk to the Archaeological Museum. It's a lovely walk. It's through the old part of town. It's um, very lively and beautiful. However, I had lost track of my days. Already I had lost track of the days and I visited on a Tuesday, which is the one day it is shut. So I walked to the Museum of Archaeology and I walked back from the Museum of Archaeology. But I did film some lovely corners of the city. So I hope that you enjoy watching and thank you very much.